Hello, welcome to this Land Sweeper vulnerability video where today I'll be covering two new vulnerabilities in iOS, iPadOS and macOS devices. So if you have any Apple devices, uh, make sure to update them so you have the latest patches available and you're protected against these new vulnerabilities. Now these two vulnerabilities can lead to arbitrary code execution, which means that if an attacker exploits this vulnerability, they could be able to do things like install programs, view, change, or delete data, or even create new accounts with full uh, admin rights so that they basically have full control over your device. So obviously, you know, with that in mind, it's important, like I mentioned, to update as soon as possible. Now, what I'm here to do is help you find out how do you get a view of all of the devices that are vulnerable, um, and get an overview of what you need to update um, as soon as possible. As in order to do this, I'm gonna head into LandSuper and show you exactly how you can get that full overview. So here I am in the reports overview of LandSuper where I'm gonna head over to security and then uh, vulnerabilities where we can find all our vulnerability audits. And then the latest one for Apple will be this one here. Um, that will give you the latest overview of all of the devices that do not have version 16.4.1 for the mobile devices or for macOS 13.3.1. Now you need to make sure that you update your devices. Any devices listed here will be out of date. So that means that you will need to update these devices as soon as possible. Now, if you want to get more information on any of these devices, obviously you can click on any of them and that will bring you to the assets overview page where you get a full overview of um, kind of hardware, software, user information and more. Now, additionally, um, there's also a component linked to Safari. Now, if you want to get an overview of what your Safari versions are on your Apple devices, you can do the same thing. Go to the reports area. Um, I'm going to use a search bar this time and just look for Safari. And you'll see here there's we have a Safari version audit, which will give you an overview of all of your Apple devices along with which Safari version they are using. So in this case, you know, we can quickly see what versions they're using. Um, we can just take a look at the blog it'll list there, which version you need to be protected. Um, and any of these devices that aren't on the latest version, you can update um, so that you're fully protected against the latest vulnerability. Um, with that, if you want to grab these reports, all you need to do is head over to your LandSweeper site where you can find them already in the reports area. And if you do not have LandSweeper yet, you can start your free trial on the website, get it set up, try it with your own data. You get the same overview that I'm previewing here. Um, and you can get that crucial information, that crucial data that you need to get kind of a list, a concrete list of which devices you still need to update and get to work on securing your IT environment. And with that, I want to thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.